Rwanda Utilities Regulatory Authority, RURA, says that 80% of motor taxi operators in Kigali have already installed smart meters. This is a directive that will see all motor taxi operators across the country have smart meters to facilitate cashless payment methods. According to RURA, from Saturday 15th, August 2020, only motor taxis with smart meters are permitted to operate in the city of Kigali. Motor taxis without smart meters will not be allowed to operate. The operators have reacted to the new directive. Uh, the benefit of this meter is that I will not have to negotiate with passengers anymore and it will expedite the process. We already have 4G SIM cards, but this meter does not connect to internet easily. It keeps searching for connection. This Yego smart meter works well despite minimal connection issues, but to a larger extent, it works well. Tap and go smart public transport cards. Yegomoto and Pasco Motors are some of the cashless payment companies which will be deployed in this method. Application managers say that they are ready to address the issues of poor internet connectivity which have marred cashless payment in public transport. So when we started to design the solution in 2016, we did a survey for about nine months and it was a technical survey plus a commercial survey to understand what are the problems that we needed to solve. One of the problems that was there was that internet does not work all the time or is not available all the time or sometimes the network gets overloaded. So our system is designed to work without internet. So we only need internet in the morning when the driver starts the day. The whole day he can function without internet including making cashless payments. So we have been able to make sure that our system can work without internet. So we will not have any of such problems about internet. We have been doing cashless payments since 2017. So we have uh, a tag that you can use and you will be able to do cashless payments. We are adding other means of cashless payments also like SPEN and we'll be adding also other wallets which are available in the market and we'll be tying up with banks also so that you will be able to use the debit and credit card. Our idea is in the times of COVID to protect both passenger and the driver by not using uh, cash. We are in contact with internet providers, MTN, Airtel and ATRN, to solve the network issues. They have promised to solve all standing issues tonight and we expect no issues by tomorrow morning. I think it is a technical issue, but it should be addressed tonight. Tap and Go will become a basic tool for Rwandans. The aim is to avoid contact transactions and protect Rwandans from contracting COVID-19. According to Tony Kramba, the director of transport at Rura, the use of smart meters is largely beneficial to motor taxi operators and urges passengers to cooperate. Motor taxi operators should be happy because the meters helps to keep data which will be used as security to help them in acquiring bank loans to upscale their businesses and grow them financially. Passengers should also know cashless payment is a great stride that they should welcome and cooperate in the implementation of contactless payment. According to Rura, motor taxi drivers operating in provinces will continue to operate without meters until implementation of smart meters is extended to all the provinces at a later time. Figures from Rura show that 21,600 motor taxi operators have already acquired smart meters in Kigali. The target is to have 46,000 motor taxi operators install smart meters across the country. Reporting for ROTV News, Ethan Tashabia.